Hi, I'm Chrissy Gala with a quick tip for lifeparticle.com. I'm a rejuvenation coach and health expert, and I've personally helped hundreds of women feast their way to a strong, lean, and sexy body. Today, I'd like to talk with you about chia seeds. And I love chia seeds because of the many benefits that they have. If you have sugar cravings, chia seeds are incredible for curbing your sugar cravings. It's also great for digestion. Chia seeds happen to soak up three times their weight in water. So it creates that feeling of fullness. It also has omega-3 fatty acids, which is found in fish. This is a great way to get your omega-3s. And I'm gonna make a chia seed pudding, or we can also call it a chia seed porridge. I'm gonna keep the chia seeds whole instead of grinding them because I like the consistency. It's almost like tapioca. So I'm gonna start by making a coconut milk. If you don't wanna make a coconut milk and make it really simple, you can just use almond milk or whatever you have at home that has a creamier consistency. And I'm gonna start making my coconut milk by adding warm water to a blender. I'm going to use coconut butter. Coconut butter is different than oil. It actually has the meat inside. It's very, very creamy. And it has a little bit of a sweet taste too. So I'm gonna add the coconut to my warm water. And then I like to add a little bit of honey as my sweetener. So what's great about this chia seed pudding is that I'm not giving up taste or pleasure. It's really sweet, it's creamy, it makes a great dessert. I'm also going to add a little bit of fresh vanilla beans, some cinnamon, and then a little pinch of salt. Anytime that I make anything sweet, I always add a little bit of salt to round out and enhance all of the flavors. And then I'm gonna blend it. Great, that's done. And the best way for me to make the chia seed pudding is to whisk the milk into the chia seeds. You wanna make sure that all of the little seeds get coated right away or else it'll get too clumpy. So I'm whisking it in there and the chia seeds are gonna start becoming very gelatinous. I like to let it soak for about an hour before I eat it. And I like to store it in a mason jar. Isn't that quick and easy? It's very, very beneficial to make a chia seed porridge like this and keep this on hand at all times. Whenever you have a craving for sugar or if you want to have that full feeling before a meal, you can have a tablespoon or two. Quick, easy, delicious, nutritious, satisfying. Little miracle chia seed. There you go.